Hello friends, welcome back to this session. Today we are going to configure GitLab uh, with uh, VS Code over the SSS protocol. And let's start. So right now I'm on my uh, project here. So here in the code uh, button, you will find the cloning options here. So there are SSH uh, command here, uh, HTTPS command over here, and you will find the ID also. So basically two IDs supporting here, the Visual Studio and the IntelliJ IDEA. This will basically automatically pop or from your system so right now i'm just going with the visual studio here over the ssh i'm just clicking here so this will ask the uh, location where we have to clone so i'm just giving them uh, one of the my location here and this will going to clone okay can you see here the error yeah so this error came here because of we have not configured the public key so let's go to configure public key i'm going to my windows uh, cell here uh, let me just make the zoom. So in this path, user, this is your username in the dot SSH directory. So this directory should have the uh, public key and private key of SSH. So since I have already created, I can see the two keys. But no worries, I'll give you how to create a command. Okay. So this command basically create a SSH key here. So let me run this command here. So this will create a key. So this will override since it's already there. Okay. So right now my key is generated now. Okay. Let me do ls again. Okay. So this key, the public key, this is the public key we have to upload in our GitLab. So let me just take the this key id rs so this key we have to copy here. So I'm doing copy. So copy is done. Now let's go to the our uh, key section in your profile SSS key. In your profile you can go to the SSS key and here add a new key you can paste this key here. So I'm adding key this one. So you can give the expiry date also. Right now our key has been created. Now let's go back again. Code uh, Visual Studio. Again, as I said, so let me close this part. Take stop this one to my location. So this will going to clone now because since we have added the key, it's asking where you want to clone. Here only I'm just asking. So here you can see clone has been done. Now you can see this is the my branch is came here and everything has been. Let's do the small code configuration here. I'm just adding new branch here, creating the branch master name. So branch has been changed here, creating one sample uh, file. Here we are just giving the simple print. I'm just saving this file, going to the version control here, get the source control. Here I'm just adding the my file, commit message simple test now i'm pushing the my code okay. so this is the button push branch so right now we are pushing branch over there so this will push the new branch master over the key so let's go here in the code section here here in the commit commit you can see this is the main branch let's go to the master branch here in master branch you can see the new commit came this is just now came here this is a new so you can create a merge request from master to main also here you can change the source and destination branch so this is my source branch this is my target destination branch you can branch uh, you can create your pull request this is the merge request the naming convention are the same so right now i'm just creating the compare branch and continue so this will compare the code what is the new game i'm just going with the default contribution create a merge request this will create a merge request you can see this is a merge request. so you can find the deep and the details over here you can give the approval here also here. so here i'm just giving the approval then we can make the merge you can set up the auto merge also this is the merge now both commits are merged in the main branch so once you go to the commit here, it will show up the 
main branch once here. So this is all about how we can clone the Git uh, repo with the SSH protocols in the GitLab uh, repository. Okay, thank you for watching this video. Please uh, like, share, subscribe. Thank you.